Welcome. If you are new viewer here, be sure to click the subscribe button and also click the bell icon so that you'll be notified about videos uploaded from this channel. You can also find us on IG at Chop City TV. That is C H O P C I T Y underscore TV. The topics that we will be discussing today is Lucifer killed in police confrontation, double murder in St. James. The police are reporting that a man was fatally shot during a confrontation with the cops on King Street, Montego Bay, St. James on Sunday. The deceased has been identified as 29-year-old Kimali Cominam, otherwise called Lucifer, Nikoi, O'Shane and X of King Street, Montego Bay. According to the police, a Taurus 9mm pistol with a magazine affixed containing four 9mm rounds of ammunition was seized. They say the incident happened during a joint police military operation in the area. The police say the matter has been reported to the Inspectorate and Professional Standards Oversight Bureau and Independent Communications of Investigations. In addition to that, the Savalamar police seized several rounds of ammunition in Chantilly Gardens in Westmoreland on Saturday, January 2nd. Reports from the Savalamar police are that about 9.40 a.m., a police team seized 13 45 cartridge along with a 27 40 cartridge during a snap raid operation in the area. No one was arrested in relation to this incident. Investigations are still ongoing. So Lucifer, you really feel like say true, you really have the name Lucifer. You did go go in confrontation with the cops and them did go fear you. Due to how him have one million and one aliases. You know, so say I will have four different aliases him one have. That for sure you how many things him do, how many life him captured, how many people him go round and turn them in an idiot. So him have to have all have four different aliases him again. Okay. Everybody Everybody we meet, he might give them one different name so they can't do catch up on him. You get where me I come from? So this man, him not sound innocent, none at all. And with that being said, probably are the things them we him do, the way how him act and how him go and make him end up with the name Lucifer. Nobody normal now get the name Lucifer. You know who is Lucifer? The devil is Lucifer. And somehow will never know you know. Me know so somehow will never really and truly know. But that ain't nothing because and everything you are gonna know. You live and you learn. And no more than him the wrong or do some evil thing and the people must say. You know said so that boy you evil. I must lose for this. You know Jamaicans really and truly give you your pet name or your nickname by how you look and the way you hack. You don't just get up and get one name. So if you see one boy down the road and him black, a black same name. Best believe it. If you see one man up there so and him fat, him name bigger or bigs. Jamaicans really and truly give you your name of how you look and how you act. So me personally feel like say this man get him name from the things them way him really a do. Him not innocent. I'm mean, not think so. And you can't be innocent not at all. No normal person. No normal smaddy will probably find a gun or get a gun from him friend. Now nah, I could just take up him gun and I in a shoot out with police. No sir. Me mean, not think so. You are going more likely for say officer, you know, say Ray Ray. Or make them find it pan you then. You know, I could just have the brave heart for just get up and start bust two shot off at the police them so not no go so a long time this brother had the things. So him have the audacity for go in front of the police them with it and the police them cut him right down. I know a lot of people I go say Jan was star we really coming at 2021 with all of this nasty behavior. But really and truly, one of the things that got am one of the things that the people them just drop them nasty a bit overnight. Remember, you know, nobody now play the soft one and give a soft answer to things and turn away the rat. You know, nobody now do that. Everybody wanna be the top one, everybody wanna be on top, everybody wanna have the last talk, and everybody wanna be done. So there is no way we are gonna move forward from all of this unless we drop all away dirty habit them all our bad mind habit them we don't need for things smart 
and leave all of this unnecessary things behind we need to give it up until we do that we can't move forward we not go better every day it just gonna get worse and worse because as me say nobody not take talk everybody want to be the one with a giddy talk everybody want to be the one on top you know so I'm not going to tell no lie still. Me personally feel like say ready I cause most of the violence and crime will really I take place in a Jamaica, you know. That one you see that one though with something and feel like say you know for have it so them want it from you. And because you know say you might work hard for your things or your auntie or your uncle or your mother or your father work hard for it and give it to you. You decide say you're not going to just give it up just like that and whosoever wants it they might come feed regardless of what you say if you say yes they might come feed if you say no they might come feed so me personally feel like say at that cause all of them look up me i go on and if you will drop out somebody over them honest things they are gonna have some family members who really and truly now nah just sit down and wait pan the cops them for do it i'm not gonna tell you like i'm not go around you know most of you know are most of we then come not to pinpoint nobody most are the jamaicans them them can't bother for wait pan the law for do things for them they want to take it up in a for them hands and that is what is causing all of the problem only need for wash out on here with little water and stop ready eye people because most of the time them you know the family must say the police them not do not the police them not take too long we can't bother the police them we have to go do this by ourselves and right there and then that is the point where nothing not gonna stop it just continue to get worse worse and worse the new years got off to a bloody start in St. James with gunman killing two men and wounding two others following a daring daylight attack in the Dam Road community yesterday afternoon. Late yesterday, detective attached to the Major Investigation Division and the Freeport Criminal Investigation Branch were still combining for clues at the crime scene. The deceased have been identified as Kenroy Sinclair, 24, who is said to be a son of a cop, and Dean Reed, 44, both of Dam Road. Reports by the Spring Mount Police are that shortly after 1.45 p.m., all four victims were among a group of persons at a location on Dom Road. When they were ambushed by a group of heavily harmed men, the gunmen opened fire hitting all four persons before making their escape from the community. The police were informed and upon arrival, the victims were discovered suffering from gunshot wounds. They were rushed to the hospital where Reed and Sinclair was pronounced dead and the two others treated and admitted in serious condition. One senior police officer in St. James said that despite seeing a reduction in murders last year, St. James saw a strike in killings during the last two months of the year 2020, ended with a total of 128 persons being murdered in the parish. Then if I just the last two months flare up Guan and a 128 persons get dashed away in a St. James. Imagine if I did the whole year. Megania, big up on yourself. Thank you guys for watching.